Huge things are happening in Animal Jam, and which side are you on? Are you on the light side, or are you on the dark side? Make sure to like and subscribe. What's up Jammers, it's Breezy and welcome back to another Animal Jam video. And today, we have a lot to cover, so let's just get into it. Okay, so right here in the Jamaa Journal, we have Light Side and Dark Side Arctic Wolves. So I believe these are located in the Premium Shop, so we will check these out. There is also an Epic Bundle for the Night of the Phantoms, and there's a Light Accelerator. Hmm, what could that be? Okay, so let's make our way over to the Sapphire Shop, and let's check out the all new Epic Bundle. Okay, so right here in the sapphire shop with this huge sign that says new is the all new epic bundle it comes with a toucan goat polar bear pet phantom phantom fortress super villain submarine a mummy outfit phantom outfit dino skeleton outfit oh my goodness so many outfits accessories den item set pet adoption tokens two of them fearsome fortress music and villainous vibe music and it is 1031 sapphires or 1031 like halloween october 31st anyways let's buy this wow that bundle was absolutely huge i felt like i spent years clicking through the amount of things that was in that bundle but it was super cool definitely i really do like this den also i've really wanted it for a while and i completely missed it when it was in stores so i'm definitely happy to have it now okay so basically everything that's happened in animal jam this past reset time really does feel like a whole new update there is so much to cover anyways okay so in the premium shop these things have real prices they're not all zero dollars and zero cents i just cannot purchase things directly off of this device anyways we have a light side arctic wolf bundle and we have a dark side arctic wolf bundle both of which are 4.99 us dollars i would like to give a huge thank you to animal jam hq for providing me with codes for both of these arctic wolves so huge thank you to ajhq as i get to show off both of these bundles for you guys so this one is the dark side arctic wolf and we get the dark side glasses the dark side arctic wolf the dark side tail and the dark side hoops and this is the dark side arctic wolf very cool very cool it has a little skull right here and then it also has a dark aura pattern thing <laughs> very cool very cool like i said huge thank you to aghq this is for the light side bundle it has the light side glasses light side arctic wolf light side tail and the light side hoops and this right here is the light side arctic wolf also very cool reminds me of juno and it also has a little light aura thing on its paws very cool oh and it leaves a trail as well okay that's also very cool very cool honestly both of these wolves are very cool i definitely like both of them i like how they stand out among the crowd of other animals in Jama, but i am going to have to go with the dark side i am on team dark side so this is my dark side arctic wolf and i am going to give it a better outfit okay so this is the breezy dark side arctic wolf I had no clue that the cowboy hat would be so huge on this animal, but it is absolutely huge. Make sure you guys tell me in the comment section which side you guys are on. Me personally, like I said, I'm on the dark side, but I want to see which side you guys are on. Okay, now let's make our way over to Jama Township and check out what is going on with the fountain or lack thereof. Okay, so right now we are in Jama Township and this is the fountain sort of so basically what happened to the fountain was um you know what i don't even know what happened to the fountain the fountain just is not fountaining anymore in the jamal journal it says that graham built the light accelerator this huge thing right here to try to help stop the phantoms from taking over and taking control of the lines of power so what i'm assuming is that when we participate in the mini game we're helping either the light side or the dark side in whatever is gonna happen so honestly this could change animal jam forever uh oh this is absolutely insane so i'm going to oh my goodness i almost ran into 
Wow, I almost read it to Serapia Forest. Anyways, so I am going to wait for a new game and I'm going to show off this new mini game to all of you and maybe give a slight tutorial on how to play if you don't already know. It's basically just like Mira says on Animal Jam Classic, if you guys know what that is. But I will show it off once a new game starts. Okay, so this is the new mini game. So each time you play, you can choose a side. You can either choose the light side or the dark side. I'm gonna click the dark side really quickly before this game times me out. So basically, there are these crystals crystals these four and they basically are just like these buttons right here so they are going to flash in a specific order and you basically just have to mimic that so right now it's green purple okay so green purple boom there we go I'm actually gonna have to do this like really fast so green purple yellow oh my goodness green purple yellow okay I could not find my mouse for a good second green purple yellow red green purple yellow red Okay, this is kind of nerve wracking. Honestly, this is kind of nerve wracking. Green, purple, yellow, red, purple. Green, purple, yellow, red, purple. Oh my goodness. <laughs> green, purple, yellow, red, purple, green. Green, purple, yellow, red, purple, green. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is definitely nerve wracking, but we got this, we got this, we got this. Boom, okay. Green, purple, yellow, red, purple, green, green, yellow. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um. Did I get it right? I got it right? Wait, what? I don't remember getting that right. Oh my goodness. I'm going to really mess this one up. Uh, I don't remember. I got it right. Wait, what? I did it? No way. I literally was not paying attention. I'm not even gonna lie. Wow. I actually did that on video. That's crazy. Any other time I play this, I usually get out by like the sixth or fifth or sixth or seventh round. So this is absolutely insane. I was not paying attention. Okay, so right now all of the dark side energy goes into the little whatever that is. And that's super cool. Okay, so I got 100 dark side points since I got 75 plus 25. That's super cool. Okay, so then basically you take your points over here to this little sign right here and then you can get yourself either a light side chest depending on how many light side points you have or a dark side chest depending on how many dark side points you have with these chests there are a ton of items basically almost every single item in animal jam almost every single item and they come in either a light side or dark side variant so these are the dark side variants they are very very cool they sort of glow and then i will quickly go over to the light side area just to show off the light side items as well these ones right here so these are the light side items so like i said i am on the dark side so i'm going to have a lot more dark side points than light side points and I have 299 dark side points so I'm going to use 200 of my dark side points to get myself a dark side chest and I am out of den inventory space one second okay we should have more space now animal jam please give us more inventory space please okay so i just got myself a dark side chest so i believe if these operate like any other chest in game you have to take it to your den and you can open it that way so you just place the dark side chest in your den like this and then you click on it you can only open this chest once are you ready to open it for a random item redeem and what is this this is a dark side palette oh color palette mask okay that's very cool so i just got myself a dark side color palette mask super cool super cool another way to get yourself some light side or dark side points is by trick-or-treating in animal jam so basically this was here last year as well but it is a little bit different this year um i can't really open up the menu because i already did my trick-or-treating for this day but basically you click on this candy icon right here and it has the little pointer that goes between light side and dark side and then whichever one it lands on you get points for that side you could hit skip and it will just give you the points automatically you know just make it go faster but basically it's random and then there are 10 of these throughout Jama.
and that is another way for you to get yourself some light side or dark side points so like i said you use those points to get yourself a chest for either light side or dark side items so basically that was a rundown of everything that is going on in animal jam right now it is definitely definitely a busy busy night of the phantoms this year so if you made it until the end of this video i'll be giving away this rainbow galaxy spike collar right here to enter all you have to do is like this video subscribe hit the bell and comment your animal jam username along with which side are you on the light side or the dark side and then also let me know your thoughts on this entire thing that's going on right now so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe follow my instagram at it's breezy underscore aj and tell me in the comment section which side are you on and what are your thoughts on everything that is going on and with that thank you all for watching and i will see you guys next time stay breezy Thank you.